Hi, it's Gwyneth here. I hope you're having a fabulous day, whatever it is that you are doing today. So this is probably my last vlog specifically about um, interviews because imagine you've done all the preparation, you're getting ready, the interview is coming up, you know you've done everything you possibly can, you've done all your research, you've done the private detective thing, looked at the vacancy notice, but there is still something inside your gut, inside your stomach, you're just not sure. Well, I would pay attention to that feeling because if you have prepared properly, if you're ready for that interview and you really want the job, what you should be feeling is a slight level of excitement at the very least. Yes, you might still be nervous, but you should be feeling excitement and not apprehension or negativity. If you are feeling negativity, think very, very carefully about taking the next step because if you get to that interview and you do get the job because you're so brilliantly prepared, and a couple of months down the line, or even worse, when they offer you the job and you say, actually, I don't really want this. You've burned your bridges with a whole load of people. You have given, you're going to be telling yourself that, you know, I never should have done that. I never should have done that. Should have listened to my instincts. And the people who are interviewing you, who also, you know, took a long time to go through the recruit recruitment process. And recruitment is so expensive these days as well. It takes such a long time to find the right person. And then you turn around and say, actually, no thank you, change my mind. Then, well, figure out how many people they all know. And if you are looking to work in the same sector and another company hears about, you know, this person turned up for interview and we offered them the job, and can you believe they didn't want to accept the position? You could be, uh, you could be messing your own future up there. So yes, it's highly unlikely that it might happen because I'm going to assume that if you've done all the work, if you've done all the preparation that you do actually want the job but as I say if you get to that to, to the day of the interview or even a couple of days before and you are still feeling apprehensive about whether this is really you know whether you're really going to do this then step away before you get to interview you'll save yourself and you will save others a lot of heartache and somebody who really really wants the job is more likely to be successful. Okay, I'll speak to you again soon. Lots of love and bye for now.